Hello Simmers, Seaweed from Tribal Soup Project here. Welcome to another episode of Simsational. You are watching University Villain and we are here with Jazz Wu at the Treehouse Restaurant ready to go on our very first date ever. So let's come into this beautiful place and this lot is available in my um in origin under my username seaweed102 i think it's titled magical treehouse restaurant oh look i forgot that a bear was the host <laughs> so let's go here together and request a table <clears throat> excuse me so one of the things that I don't like about the dates is that if you didn't ask the person out on a date, then what's happening? What the heck is happening? That person just became a vampire right before our very eyes. It's a vampiric bear. Let me see your fangs. <laughs> That's so funny. I can't believe that just happened. That is really funny. So back to what I was saying. Um, one of the things I don't like is that unless you ask the person on the date, we don't get to see all the stuff that we need to do to make it a good date. So luckily, I'm very familiar with what it takes for a good date. So I'll just... Uh, try to keep up with those interactions try to kind of guess what we're supposed to do here so let's order for the table Vancouver all right love potion number four it's pretty early to start drinking do they have breakfast here do they have breakfast are we gonna have breakfast they don't have breakfast we're gonna have brunch we're gonna have us some brunch. So let's, I guess we'll have a fizzy fruity drink. A fizzy fruity, we shall. <laughs> um, and then let's have, ooh, a space taco with pearled egg. That sounds weird. So let's try it. <laughs> There we go. I also find it a little bit annoying that even though Jazz asked us out on the date, we're going to have to pay for it. But, you know, since we are an armed robber, money really is no object for us because we can just steal everything we want. So um, let's go ahead and get these interactions. Let's do a little flirting. Oh, we know we have to do 10 friendly interactions for a date. So we'll ask about dance techniques. We'll ask, we'll brighten her day. We will ask about career. Oh, we already know she's a university student. Um, uh, we will, let's see, where's those get to know ones? Deep conversation. Um, we need to do a couple deep conversations. Three, I believe. Two. Um, where's like get to know? Get to know. Jazz is unemployed. Doesn't she go to school though? Oh, okay, that was, that's right. I forgot there's an interaction. We asked her about her degree. That's what we had asked her before. Um, express admiration. She's evil. Oh, just like us. We're evil too. We are evil too. I think we're perfect together. Complained about classes. Can you believe that we did not successfully cheat on our homework? We got caught. How annoying is that? <laughs> um, discuss logic puzzles. We need to do another deep conversation. I think that's three then. So that's good. Um, I should have been keeping track of how many interactions we've done. Complain about the sunny weather. Ooh. Everything is all sparkly and fizzy. Eat and learn experimental food and drink. Fenafina's. Fenafina Wanoos. Okay. 
So now we have to do three meal interactions. Brainstorm methods of chef napping. I, I that's like probably my favorite one. It probably absolutely I think is. Beam blissful feelings of food transcendence. <laughs> Ultrabot contest. Oh, neat. Oh, neat. Yibs. What else we got here? We need one more. Question meal social con consciousness. Oh, my God. That's funny. <laughs> one more lady, and that'll be three, and then you can eat your food. They're just like, where are you going? What are you doing? Lady, get back here. Where are you going? <gasps> Maybe she's got to pee. No, because the bathroom's upstairs. Where are you going? Where's this lady going? <gasps> Holy freaking hell, Batman! Are you joking? Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god, no! No, 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 no! Plead for jazz! Plead for jazz! Quick, lady! Quick! 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 Plead! Plead, plead, plead! Oh my god, I can't believe that just happened! I can't believe that just happened! Our very first girlfriend! Jazz Wu is truly gone after the car accident. Shupaza, please. Oh my God! What is happening? What is happening? I must have these. Tragedies occurring at a fast rate or something. Oh my god, I can't believe that just happened. I'm so sad now. She doesn't seem to be too upset though. What the freak? What the freak? I cannot believe that just freaking happened. Should we take her tombstone with us? I don't know if we can. We're taking it. Put it in the inventory. I can't believe that that happened. I'm so surprised. I cannot believe that that happened. Uh -huh. That's so sad. She really does not. I mean, she's got a sad mood lit over here, but she's like, not really that sad. I guess we should have a funeral. I can't believe that just happened. And you're all needy too. And you're needy lady. And your girlfriend just got ran over by a car. And you're still freaking flirty. What is wrong with you? Oh my god, this lady is truly fucking not believe that happened. Okay, let's get the freak out of here. Let's get out of here. Can't believe our girlfriend is dead. I decided that we were going to go ahead and have a funeral, but unfortunately the funeral mod does not seem to be working. But I did remember that I actually built a graveyard nightclub some time ago. So I think we're going to go ahead and place Jasmine's, Jazz's tomb, 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 I can speak, tombstone here so that we can visit it whenever we would like to. Um, and maybe we will have ourselves a little drink or two. And just kind of, you know, mourn our girl whose life was cut so short, so soon. 
I'm still slightly in shock that this has happened. <laughs> oh, oh, it's so sad. It's so sad. Oh, Jazz. We had seen such a bright future with you. What the heck is happening? This guy is turning into a vampire too? What is with the vampire? What the heck? I mean, we are here in um, the vampire neighborhood, but I mean, that's two people we've seen change into vampires recently. That's a little bit crazy. So let's actually come down here and um, get ourselves, where's the bartender? There's no bartender? There's no bartender. Where's the bartender at? What are they doing, hanging out outside? Who are you, are you the bartender? No. Why is there no bartender here? I just don't know. Nothing's going according to plan at all. Nothing at all. All right, well, I guess we'll just, oh, there he is. Oh, it was the bartender who turned into a vamp. Where are you going? She's just going to sit there. No. She, come sit at the bar. Come sit at the bar, lady. Maybe he'll come back down. What are you taking a nap for? Oh, my God. Look how hungry she is. Oh, my God. Is she so tired, too? And it's only four in the afternoon. Crazy. It's all so crazy. Where are you, bartender? Oh my god, are we going to have to make our own freaking drink? But here he comes. Here he comes. She is still, like, happy. Like, she has sad moodlets, but she's still mostly happy. I can't believe that. Alright, so let's order a drink. Let's have something easy. Let's go ahead with an EPA. Charmed. We'll have an EPA. Drown our sorrows in a beer. Thank you so much, bartender. And I guess, um, whoa, where'd that bar go? That was weird. So I guess we will go ahead and get our drink on and maybe, you know, I don't know, do a couple mischievous interactions. What are these skills like? Let's see. Her mischief is at level eight. So we're going to try to get those up. Oh, she's very sad now. She's so sad. Let's see. Brag about or ask about her prized possessions. Let us know where you live. We're going to come and steal everything you got, lady. Oh, she's so sad. She is so sad. Uh, invite the fake party. Uh, we're going to invite you to that funeral that we're not uh, actually going to have. <laughs> Bad boy Rob Ovi. <laughs> Describe apocalypse. You better be careful. You might get hit by a car too. Um, start preposterous rumor. Install with false confidence. That's a good little kickoff on working a little bit more on our mischief skill. Oh, we're so hungry. We didn't order anything to eat. Order fish and chips. Fish and chips. Bring a dope a shell. Isn't this nightclub so cool? I like always forget that I built this. Obviously, I built it for vampires, so I, I really like it. It's cool because, like, you get in there by going through the mausoleums. It's all underground. I love it. I love it. So we are going to go ahead and solve this hunger. And, oh, my God, she, what is happening? This person is turning into a vampire too? I don't get that. 
I don't get it at all. That's so weird. That's absolutely weird. Oh my god, look at her. She's so red right now. Hurry up and finish your food. Stop talking. You ain't got no time to talk. Finish your food so we can get out of here. I think we're going to go home, go to the bathroom, and um, we're turning in early because look how depressed she is. She's so sad. <laughs> of course I say that that she starts laughing insanely. All right, lady, let's go. Let's take yourself to bed. Tomorrow's a new day. This too shall pass. Well, so that was very surprising and very sad. And we are going to go ahead and go to the bathroom and get ourselves some sleep. And tomorrow will be a new day. So that's about it guys we will see you in the next episode if you are enjoying the series or if you know why the funeral mod is not working please do leave something down into the comment below like the video subscribe to the channel check out some of the other cool stuff we got going on out there and until next time guys happy simming and i'll catch y'all later goodbye